Hey guys! Hi! Okay, it's beauty battle time. Uh, we've picked something new to both of us that we've never tried before. Um, the Chic Intuition Renewing Moisture Razor. Here's the packaging. Um, okay, we'll go ahead and just say the scent is pomegranate, pomegranate extract. And this is one of those two-in-one deals. Yes. Where the razor... Okay, the razor has built in this built in balm kind of thing at the top that takes the place of your shaving cream. Yeah, it says so, on the packaging that you lather, it lathers and moisturizes as you shave. No need for shave gel, soap, or body wash. And yep. I was like, do what? It says how it works what shaver to activate skin conditioning solid, keeping both skin and razor wet as you shave. Press, oh. <laughs> As you shave, press gently. <laughs> Don't try to cut your legs off. No. That's what it's saying. Don't. Um, okay, so let's okay. show what it looks like. So the head kind of pivots. Not a lot, but a little bit. Um, this is creamy, um, and it lathers a little bit. Tiny, tiny bit. Um, it comes with one refillable cartridge. And it also, and also comes with the little shower holder, little caddy. Could you stick right on your shower wall? Yeah. And, I mean, you can, once you're done with it, you can pop the lid on it so that I guess the moisture in your shower won't, you know, affect yeah. it. And just, you know, let it hang in your shower stall like that. Yeah. Um, a good grip handle. It's got some, like, rubber cushiony grip there. Yeah, it's pretty big. Yeah. Okay. So. Oh, and it has four blades. I'm not sure if that matters. Right? Yes. yes. Four, four. four blades. Um, let's say, okay, before we tell each other what we think about it, I was forgot to bring the razor that I usually use, but literally, I mean, seriously, it's cheap. It's, a, it's called a Gillette Daisy, and it's the little disposable pink one. I think it has two or three blades. You can get a bag of like 12 of them for like seven bucks at Target or a drugstore. That's what I've used forever. We did a video, like, our behind-the-scenes mm -hmm. products. I think we showed that. And what did you use? I used, like, the Gillette Venus Embrace or something like that. Disposable ones? The, um, or no, do you keep it's, them? I keep them, and then I buy the little refill cartridges for them. Okay. And I, ne I normally just use, like, Target shaving cream, like, the gel. Not, not okay. a cream, but a, a gel. Yeah, me too. Okay. All right. What do you think? Um... I didn't think it gave me a close enough shave. I wish that it gave me closer. Um, I felt still stubbly after I used it, and there are things about this that I don't quite understand, which I think, um, I'm curious. To see. Okay, first okay. of all, what do you think? I liked it. I say it that way. Okay, first time I used it, I don't know if you had the same thing. First time I used it, I, um didn't get used to this stuff okay so I was using it and like this thing's not shaving yeah I didn't have it angled right on my leg um I literally f okay with my Gillette Daisy I can literally feel the razor going across my skin and mm -hmm. getting and, and taking the hair off mm -hmm. you don't I didn't feel that with this mm -hmm. um but I did think as soon as I like I almost put my leg up here like that would be attractive <laughs> as soon as I like shaved I ran my hand and it was really smooth. See, I don't, maybe I'm not applying enough pressure. It was really smooth. However, I'm curious because I've only used mine about three times. I've used mine twice. Something in me is saying that my hair is growing back at a faster rate than with my normal razors. So it's not maybe pulling, it's maybe, maybe not getting it. That's what I'm thinking. Close. Um... Today I have one leg done in this and one leg done in my daisy. Which we'll is link, brilliant. I we'll talk I... about it below. Like if I notice a difference, we'll make sure to let you know. I if... wish I'd thought about doing I one, thought about one it this morning in the shower and I was like, um, I did think it was really smooth feeling. I wish that it lathered more. I didn't think it See, could... I don't mind that. Okay. But it doesn't really lather. No, it doesn't. Like you can just see you a little, see little bit, of... bit of soapiness yeah. to it. Um... I also thought that I had a little bit of razor burn feeling afterwards. Oh, I didn't have that. And I don't know why. I don't I don't feel like I have that with my normal shaving cream and razor. So um 
I'm gonna keep using this just because it's a product now that I have and I own. She is and waving that razor is too close. I'm just kidding. Good, good, good. <laughs> um, yeah, but I'm gonna I'm gonna keep trying it. But I'm probably gonna go back to my conventional razor and shaving gel from. Well, I have to ask Mindy a couple questions. Did you you shaved your legs? Yes. Your armpits? Nope. I didn't Nothing trust else? this on my armpits. Okay. Are we gonna get? I did my armpits. Yeah. And it didn't even feel like I was doing anything. I mean, it did the trick, but... You know, another thing is it's it's kind of noisy. Why did that... Because it get, it's yeah, flexy. It's it, flexy. It's And it's when it pivots, it's, you know, the plastic joints are, like, hitting each other. I don't know. Every time I touched it to my leg, though, to do another stroke, I was like, it's noisy. I didn't mind that. <laughs> I am going to talk about something that will probably embarrass people, but I also tried it on my bikini line. Yeah. I didn't. I did. I didn't trust it. I'm, I was like, oh, no, 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 no. I got in there and tried it <laughs> everywhere. Um, I will say there that that is too big of a product. To get where yeah. you want to get. It's it's too big of a product. Um, well. <laughs> <laughs> it's too large. It's too bulky right there. Uh, but like I said, one side, what I normally do, one side, this thing, and yeah, I will try to write a little something. Yeah, maybe like an update. underneath we'll have a little update of what Jamie thought. And maybe I'll even try doing yeah. that to do a comparison. Because by the time this video goes up, we will have had a chance to use this some more. Yeah. So. But I will, I will say this. I really want to like this, so I'm going to keep doing it. Because this whole two-in-one thing, for me, I dig it. I'm like in the shower. I don't know why. It doesn't take that much longer to... Put your stuff in here and rub it on your legs and stuff. It really doesn't. I actually but, like that part of my shower. Oh, see, I think I, I want laser hair removal. Let me just throw <laughs> that out there. I want to never have to do that again, and eventually I'm going to get there. Oh, just a little plug, a little side note. If anyone locally does ha laser hair removal, can you please email me? Um, let me know who you see because it is something in the future that I want to do. But I'm going to continue to use it. I'm not sold on it 100%. But I like this simple factor of two in one, and I did like how smooth my legs felt after using it. I'm just not sure that they yeah. were smooth for as long as maybe my other razor would be. Okay, and I I don't I didn't enjoy it enough to really say that I I love it or okay. Um, and like I said, I did feel a slight bit of like razor burn feeling, which I don't feel any other time. So I was like, because I worried that maybe because I felt the razor burn effect that maybe I was applying it too hard. I bet her legs were just really I'm just Oh my god. I'm kidding. Is she calling me extra hairy. I'm kidding. Oh my gosh. Um I'm the dark haired one here, so you guys with dark hair know what I'm talking about. You have, you know it shows it, it shows show. way more than others. But I felt like um I was probably applying it and the pressure too hard if I was getting razor burn, but then I also didn't feel I felt like I had still stubble. Yeah, so maybe I wasn't that. applying enough pressure. I don't know. Yeah. I just, I think I'm an old-fashioned conventional girl, and I'm probably going to stick with my, my other yeah. razor. I will say that I'm excited to go try it again. Okay. But yeah, I probably will do it. Yeah. Okay, one last thing. It just reminded me this morning when I tried that and the other one, um, like I said, I could tell the other one. Once, that I didn't like. I knew that my Gillette Daisy was doing its job, but the harshness that it was, it made my leg feel, like you can really feel it, the blade cutting the hair off. You're like, I didn't have half inch hair, okay? I had just like <laughs> teeny tiny stubble. I'm just saying you could feel it. And with that, I felt nothing. You like that? I like that, but I know that I, I like I said in my mind, I think that my Daisy is, is keep keeping it off longer but we'll try to update you below we're gonna this video probably is not gonna go up today that we're right. today so we'll update you all right we always do a thumbs up or a thumbs down i give it uh this are you three quarters down i'm three quarters down i am i'm gonna be the little bit opposite i'm gonna be three quarters <laughs> up i can't okay. do a full because yeah. i'm not sure but i'm half to here like that <laughs> but we'll see. We'll keep using it. What do you guys use? Yeah, we're but, curious. We're nosy. We want to know what's going on in your bathroom. Let's get personal. Well, not everything in your bathroom, but some things. <laughs> so let us know if you've ever tried anything like this.
sorry. Cool. I'm, tr I'm trying not to decapitate either I one of us. I swear I'm going to miss an eyebrow any second now. <laughs> little, little slashes in my eyebrow. Oh, that'd be hot. <laughs> <laughs> All right, you guys. Thanks. Leave us a comment. Let us know what you think. And thanks for watching. Bye. Bye.